This is a quick breakdown on the Adidas Own the Game. So these shoes retail for $70, making them a much more affordable option. And I think they kind of look that way too. Not a ton going on with the appearance. So getting straight into the cushioning, these are going to get light motion cushion. And honestly, you're not going to see any boost, any bounce, you know, kind of stuff like that. And that's how they feel. Not a ton of padding under the foot. So for cushion, we'll just start off with a 2.5 out of 5. For materials and support, that's a spot where these keep that cheaper feel. Just not a ton of overlays or any type of help to go along with it. And the upper does feel a little bit thin. So we'll just go 3 out of 5 for support. But finishing off with the traction that's where these perform the best you have some thicker grooves to help with the outdoors there's some minor sliding but they honestly catch the floor pretty decent so we'll go four out of five for traction but let me know down below what you think about the adidas on the game and let me know what shoe you guys want to see next but until next time peace